Hi guys, welcome back to another video on my channel. Hi guys, welcome back to another video on my channel. For today's video, we're going to be doing something super exciting. We're going to be doing my updated photo card collection uh, video. Um, disclaimers for this is that I have to film this in the worst way possible. Of course, if you guys don't know anything about this channel, if you're new here, everything I do is really ratchet. Like, I'm sorry, but it's just the truth. So yes, this will be filmed really horribly. Um, I'm filming this in my kitchen. Nobody's home, but the dogs are here, and so the dogs may or may not walk around, especially as I talk. They might, like, start wandering. I don't even know. Um, but yeah, it is the kitchen. Um, so yes, we are on my kitchen counter. Uh, of course, this is filmed just like so, 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 so horribly. But I wanted to get this video up for you guys, and this is the place with the best lighting. So here we go. I have five photo card binders right now. I have my BTS binder, my second alt group binder, my Stray Kids binder, my boy groups binder, and my girl group binder. Um, I have been collecting since 2018, like the beginning of 2018. So that kind of gives you guys an idea of all of that. If you guys want to see my album collection, I will link that down below. I have an updated album collection video on my channel. And yes, we're going to get right into it. We're going to start with the one that you guys may be most excited for. I don't even know. But we're going to start with BTS, and we're going to work our way all the way to girl groups. So let's get it. Okay, so this is my, oh my god, you can see me. I'm kind of standing like this because this is the only way I can film it. I'm sorry, you guys. So this is my BTS binder. Um, like I said, BTS, uh, I didn't say this, but BTS is my old group for those of you guys who don't know. Um, I absolutely adore them. Obviously, I know we all whipped to them. I am so excited for map this whole seven. Uh, Pre-order it, guys. Just saying. Um, but yes, this is my BTS binder. So we're going to get right into it. I really, really like these binders. These binders are from Staples. Um, not all of them are like this, but I like the little pouchies. I don't know why. I'm kind of like high key obsessed with the pouchies but not all of them are pouchies which is kind of upsetting but anyways um moving into this let me see if i can zoom in a little bit okay so i zoomed you guys in a little bit um as much as i can um most of this is the same so i'm not going to go in depth with every single card um but we have Ori late 2 we have um school love affair right no this is this is dark and wild, I'm sorry. HOH part one, I believe. This is the group cards um, for those ones. This is You Never Walk Alone. And this is my ARMY membership card. Um, I just covered up my name and my little code. Oh, there's another code here. I'm gonna put my hand here. Um, then we have some dark and wild um, stickers and a postcard. Then we have the um, School of Affair little bookmarky thing. And then we go into like Young Forever and H Y H. So I think this is H Y H, and this is H Y H, and this is Young Forever. If I'm not mistaken, I actually don't remember, guys. I'm really. Also, there might be a glare. I'm so sorry. I'm trying to make it unglary. Um, and then we go into Wings. This is just a freebie that I keep to hold space because the Wings Polaroids fit really well in these pockets. So I have Yoongi and Jin and Namjoon and JK. Super cute. And then we go into Love Yourself Her. For Love Yourself Her, I have quite a lot of photo cards. I like to buy albums and then just like not use them, but I just like photo cards. I don't like to buy photo cards, but I like to buy albums. I don't understand like myself. Honestly, my, my life process is very, very whack. But as you can see, we have some of them. So I think this is L. This might be the O version. I'm pretty sure this is the L version. This is the O version. I don't remember, but it's like L-O-V-E. I'm pretty sure. I'm not sure, actually. Um, I got a lot of JK Tin and uh, V. Uh, and then I got my one Yugi kind <laughs> Um, super super cute. I do want to get more of course, but I'm just doing it slowly. Um, I'm not really prioritizing anything at the moment And then we have all of the her notes, which I like to put in my binder so people don't um, And then we have the little big hit ads, which I don't know why I put there, but I put them there And then we have tier. So for tier we have the Y version um, O version, U version And then the R version. Most of the photo cards, like I said, I do pull in albums i just buy a lot of albums but some of them i do buy um so a lot of the yoongi photo cards you see i have bought so like these two were bought um separately and then i do want to get an extra y and an extra r just to make it look a little cuter but i'm not prioritizing that like i said um and then these are the tier standees um i have four of them but one of them's in my room somewhere um and then these are the notes and then, of course, the big hit ads, and then we get into Answer. So Answer, I have bought less albums significantly, but um, I have bought, like, seven F albums, and, like, every single time I pull J-Hope, um, I just give them away. I think I used to just give away photo cards like this, and, like, I honestly regret my life decisions, but um, as you can see, I have the S-E-L-F. Um, this one I did buy, by the way. So, yeah, and then we have the notes. 
and then we have the big hit ad and then we get into persona um so for persona i have quite a bit of cards um like i said i like to buy albums i have it i have a problem um so if we have version one version two version three and then version four i do want to get one more version one just so it looks nicer but not prioritizing it like i said and then we get into the postcards i have a full um ot7 postcard set so you have jin yingi j-hope and namjoon and jimin tete and chungu and then for chungu i have an extra because i don't know i think his is damaged actually if i'm not mistaken it's damaged but um and then we get the limited edition standee which i did pull which is very exciting oh my god there's husky hair everywhere i swear to god these dogs hate me um and then we have all of the film strips which are just sitting there and then we have the notes for persona and then the big hit ad and this is more of like a random bts page so we have the love yourself tour dvd photo card i got yoongi we have bts world i got um, J JK and Yoongi and then for like contact lenses I do buy um, BTS contact lenses when I'm in Korea for those of you guys who don't know I did do a semester abroad in Korea and I'm going back for another semester um, in a month um, so I got these from d the different contact lenses I've gotten I don't remember which one's which but this was the DNA idol lens and these are the boy with love lenses i'm pretty sure and then i went to the final tour um in seoul and i got one time i got to go to like the mini photo card boothy thingy and i did pull jins which is super cute because he's my bias record and yeah very happy about that and then we go into the army uh army bomb third generation army bomb photo cards so we have a full set of those and then these are from the love yourself tour not lo just, just, just love yourself tour um i bought these when i went to the love yourself tour in los angeles um and then these are from the final um, in Seoul. I bought two sets of them. These ones I only bought one, but these ones I bought two. So you can see I have two for each member. Super, super cute. Um, and then I got two units, which are super, super cute. And then I also bought the mini photos. So I have a full set of mini photos. I did not know you could buy two mini photos. I thought you could only buy one. So I only have one set of mini photos. And then these are from my ARMY membership kit. I have all seven of the ARMY PD, BTS cinema thingy majiggy. I don't even know what those are called. And then since I was in Korea, I also bought BTS Medi-Heal masks. So I got um, just one thing of Medi-Heal masks, but I got the postcard set. So I have all seven of them as well. These are super, super pretty, by the way. I absolutely adore them. Um, and then for my army membership, you get a random members like little thingy majiggy. So I got gyms, super, super cute. And then this is the BTS. Uh, world little ticket thing and then these are just some freebies like this i got with my contacts these are just freebies i've gotten like i think i got one of these at when i went to see a bts movie and then these are just some more freebies and then some of my love yourself tickets um i don't know what happened to my love yourself speak yourself tickets like i really would love to know what happened to them but i have no idea but these are definitely from the love yourself and then i have all of my the final tickets and then just some more random stuff so yes that is my bts binder i'm quite happy with it um they definitely need their own space because there's just so much stuff. And then obviously in here, it's just like more free stuff, like the Metahuel stuff. A lot of BTS, like the codes you get from Bikit. And yeah, that's basically the end of this binder. And now we're going to move on to the next binder, which is my next alt groups. Okay, so this binder holds EXO, NCT, Super M, Taemin, Wanna One, and Wanna One solos. She's getting thick. I don't know what I'm going to do with her. Honestly, like, I'm, I'm a mess. My binders are such a mess. Like, it stresses me out, but it's okay. So for this one, um, this one does not have a cool pocket, by the way. I knew this was going to happen. Uh, so I have all my freebies and stuff in an uncool pocket, which is terrible. Um... That's symmetrical. That's probably fine. So we start off with EXO, which is my second favorite boy group. Um, I feel like a lot of people don't know that, but they are. Um, I'm not gonna go in depth, like I said, with every single photo card, but it starts from the like the earliest to the latest. So this is from like Growl, Overdose, Exodus, Love Me Right, Sing For You. Uh, I don't know what that is. Sing For You. Do I have three Sing For Yous? Oh, this is exact, and then this is exact, and that's exact. Ah. Okay, I messed up the photo cards. It's fine. I'll fix it. I'll fix it at another point. Okay, and then we go into like Lotto. We have this is Universe, and then we go into Don't Mess Up My Tempo, which I have four for all four versions, and then we go into Let Me Write. I mean, no, 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 no. Love Shot, Love Shot. Um, for Love Shot, I do have two of the shot version, I believe, um, because Amazon was a coward and sent me two of the same version, and I was just, I just, I just wanted all of them, so I kept all of them. <laughs> Um, and then we go into Obsession. So I have all three versions, the EXO version, the XXO version, and the Obsession version. So this is the EXO, the XXO, and this is the Obsession, but I love this photo card so, so much. I'm, no pun intended, but all the pun intended, I'm obsessed with this photo card. Um, and then we go into, like, postcardy things. So this is from Mama. This is the photo card, photo card I got. Um, this is from... 
what is it called? Ah, uh, Winter Special 2016. Um, yeah, I got Kyungi, and then I got this. Oh, for life, that's what it's called. And then these are my Tempo postcards. So I got Chanyeol, Beck, and Shimin. Super cute. And then this is the Love Shot poster. I thought I'd keep it in here because it's really small. I don't know. It's cute. And then we go into ExoCBX. Okay, I'm gonna try to we're like figure out if it's out of focus, but I'm also not looking up at the viewfinder, so I'm sorry. We're gonna go to ExoCBX next, though. Um, they are my favorite Exo subunit that they've done. They've only done two subunits, but like ExoCBX over everything in the entire world. Um, I do have a full ExoCBX collection. I don't even know why I have this many photo cards, but I do. So this is my CBX collection. I have two Chens, two Bex, and three Shumins, and then these are from Blooming Days, and then these are from Hey Mama, I think. Yeah, I'm correct. Um, and then we get the little postcards, which are super, super, super cute. I love the postcards. And then the stickers that come with, I think this is Blooming Day stickers, which are super, super cute as well. And then we get into Beck's solo stuff. For those of you guys who don't know, Beck is my bias. So, of course, when he did City Lights, I was, like, obsessed. And I also collected a lot of his, like, random cards when I was in Korea. So, I have all of those. So, these are from City Lights. I have both the day day and the night version. And this is from his Love Shot standee. This is his Super M standee with his Super M lenticular thing. And then his City Lights standee. Okay, uh, back to Beckyun. Um, one of my dogs literally just vomited. Thank you, dog. Um, this is like a Nature Republic freebie and it is Beckyun. You guys just can't see it. Um, and then this was something else I got at Nature Republic. That's like another little Beck freebie. So I thought I'd put it there as well. That's my little Beckyun shrine page. Then we go into XOSC, which I absolutely adored as well. Um, so I obviously collected. Um, so this is all three versions of their album. I got Chanyeol for all three versions because Sehun avoids me, and that's just that on that. Um, and then I have the postcards for them as well. And then we go into NCT 127. Um, for NCT, I don't really like put them in order of like my bias. I don't know why NCT 127 is first. I don't know. NCT Dream is my favorite, but. That's that. Um, so like I said, I'm not going to go into all of these either, but like we have um, their first mini, no, yes, first mini, we have Cherry Bomb, this is from Chain, their Japanese uh, debut, and then Regulate Irregular, and then we go into Regulate because I have a lot of Regulate photo cards because um, I collected a lot of the albums, and then this is from Regulate? Yes, okay, this is from Regulate as well, and then this is We Are Superhuman, um, and then I got another We Are Superhuman, and then these are these. And then this is from the uh, We Are Superhuman standee, because I only collect standees for my biases, and Johan's my bias, so I decided to get his. And then these, these are like random stuff, this is uh, from Limitless, and then this is from the first mini, or well, NCT127, and then this is like a wristband I got when I saw them, and then this is like a little thingy that I got when I saw them, um, just like little memory things. And then we go into like the Ugly Limitless stickers, for the postcard I got the group postcard, and then we go into all of the ugly stickers, la la la. And then I put like all of the members with their heads, because I don't know, I saw somebody do it and I was like, that's kind of nice, it's trying to make them less ugly, but they're really ugly, so it's fine. Uh, you always, there's like a layer, I'm sorry. Um, and then these are from when I saw them on tour. Um, I went to their, I don't even remember what it was called, tour, but I got some of these, uh, Superstar SM card thingy majiggies, yes. Uh, so I got Taehyung, Yuta, Jaehyun, and Mark. Um, super cute, love those. And then these are the regular, regular, uh, postcards. I'm gonna have all of them because if you guys haven't seen my unboxing for that, they really screwed up. I didn't get one photo card, but I got ten uh, postcards, so yeah, that was fun. And these, uh, these are the Mirror Superhuman postcards as well. Um, I have two because I bought two albums. And then for regular, regular, I have both of my posters in here. I don't know why, but I have both win win posters and I have them in my binder for some reason. Yes, I could probably take them out and it will lessen a lot of space, but here we are. Um, and let me go to the regulate thanks to, so we have Taehyung and then Taeyong. Some of them have names in the back, just so I know who's who, but it's mostly age order. Um, and then Yuta, and then Jaehyun, and then Jungwoo, ooh, ooh. <laughs> and then uh, Mark, <laughs> and Taechan. So very, very cute. Um, and that's my NCT 127 little shrine. And then we go into NCT 2018, which I have a few photo cards for. Um, I actually really like how this looks because it's really conveniently my biases from all three subunits. Uh, Subunits, so we have 127, Dream, and Wavy, uh, Jaehyun, Jaemin, and Kuhn. Um, only this card and then these two are real. These three are fake, but I didn't know that they were fake, but I bought them anyways. I don't know. The whole thing with that on eBay, but yes, I do have these, and I like them. I don't mind that these are fake. Like, really, you guys can't tell, and like, it looks pretty, so I don't care. And then these are just some freebies. And then for the Dream Journals, um, I have Jeno and Tail. So, super, super cute. And then we go into my boys, my dreamies, and... 
love my love of my life. Um, so for them we have from the first we have Heitan, from We Young we have Ranjun, we have We Boom, uh, Jisong, Ranjun, uh, Heitan, and Changla, and then from We Go Up we have Ranjun and Jisong's ID card, and then like a little freebie because it's cute. Ooh, ooh. Um, and then we have uh, this is the Kino card. I got Heitan's, and then we have all the Circle cards, and then this is Jamin's Standy card because like I said, I collect my bias standies as much as I can. So yes, super cute. And then we have the We Go Up. Um, Stickers, super super cute, and then we have the Wee Boom scratch cards. So I have Ranjin and Jamin's, which isn't completely scratch. I don't know why. Um, and then I also have another Jamin and Jisung. I would like to trade one Jamin, but like honestly, I don't care. I'm kind of just in this like I don't care. And then we have the Wee Boom four by six photos. So we have Ranjin, Jeno, uh, Heitan, Jamin, Chungwa, and Jisung. And then we have the Kino. Um, wait, we move the Kino. Oh, we also have a good card. <laughs> the Kino cards are super, super cute though. I absolutely adore them. So I put them side by side because they're so pretty. Um, and in the back, like of this one, it's super, super cute. I love these. Um, so, so much. I love my voice. Um, I did want to get the We Are Superhuman Kino and the Baekhyun City Lights Kino, but those were sold out when, when I was in Korea. So, a loss. A loss for Ariel. But anyways, also they're really expensive. Like, I hate spending money. <laughs> uh, then we go into Wavy. I only have, um, Take Over the- no, what is this? Yes, Take Over the Moon. Um, I only have that one because Take Off is really hard to find in America, and in Korea, and anywhere. And it's really expensive, so I'll get it eventually, but for right now I only have that. So I have 10 and Lucas' circle card. And then we go into Super M. So for Super M, I have three copies of the American version and then all eight of the Korean version. That's how I wanted to do it. So I have two Kai's and Mark and then this is from the pop-up store. I got this Taeyong in 10 photo card and then I got Baekhyun's um, tattoo. I am trading this one um, but I'm holding it for my friend because she wants to trade with me. And then for the Korean version, you can see I have all of these. I have three of the same Lucas. If anybody wants to trade, you can let me know but if not, that's cool too. I could live with it, maybe, maybe not, I don't know. I'm trying to find a trade, but I can't, so it's okay. And then I have the Super M postcards, which are so pretty. Like, I absolutely adore these. Like, the pop-up shop had just the best merchandise. Like, what is this? What is this? I love it. Um, and I just, I adore them. I adore this whole concept. Like, a lot of people hated it, but I really, really liked shopping, and I really liked their mini album as well, so... That's that on that. And then we go into Taemin, who isn't really an ult for me, but since I had his Super M stuff in here and I don't collect shiny, I was like, all right, we'll put Taemin in here. So I did buy one version of Want. Uh, I don't know what mini album it is for him, but I bought it because it was on such a good deal in Korea. I think I got it for like $7. So I was like, of course, Taemin. Um, so I got this photo card and his little standee, which is so cute. And then we go into 101. I do have a full 101 collection. 101 was one of my old groups, but they kind of did or whatever. So yes. For the first mini, we have the sky version and the pink version of 2B1. So I have Sungwoon and Jisung. And then for the second mini, Nothing Without You, I got uh, Ong and Jisung as well. I pulled a lot of Jisung. And then these are just freebie cards. Um, And then for... Oh, I promise you, uh, for the day version, we have Sungwoon and Sungwoon's uh, little puzzle piece. And then for the night version, we have Minhyun and Jinyoung, um, Jinyoung's puzzle piece. And then I also bought another copy because um, at a store in Korea, you could see the photo cards that they sell. And they were selling it with Daniel's photo card for like a really, 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 really good price. And Daniel's my bias, so I wanted one of his photo cards. And then for the little circles, I have Jihoon and Daehwon, and then I have some of the golden tickets. And then for um, undiv Undivided? Is it called Undivided? Yeah, I think it's called... What is this called? Hello? What are you called? I'm pretty sure it's called Undivided. Um, I have all of them. So for the 101 version, I have Jihoon and Ong. And then for Triple Position, I have Jaehwan and Mujin. And then for number one, I have Jin Young and Jihoon. Um, these ones are photo cards, and these ones are magnets. Kind of annoying because they're super heavy, but it's okay. And then for Lean On Me, I have Jisung Jisung. And then for the heel, I have Ong and Ong. And then for the art book version, you get all um, 11 photo cards, which is super, super cute. So I do have an all OT 11 set. These are in age order, except for Daniel and Jay Juan are flipped, but I put Daniel in the middle because he's my bias. And that's that on that. And then we have the Maknae's right here. And then for A Power of Destiny, I got Ong and Jisung, which is super, super cute. And then these are the stickers from the Power of Destiny. These are the calendar standees from Nothing Without You. So I got Daehui and Sungwoon. And then for the other version, I got Ong and Minhyun, which are super, super cute. And these are like the strips that you get in some of the albums. So this is the first mini, and then this is Power of Destiny. So I got um, Daehui, Jihoon, Jaehwan, and Jisung, which is super, super, super cute. Oh, I just... 
completely. I'm so sorry. Okay. I'll fix that later. And then those are some more golden tickets. Um, you get a lot of golden tickets in one-on-one hours. I still don't know what they did back in the day, but that's besides the point. Uh, these are this is Daniel's solo page. Uh, excuse my messy hangul. Um, I only have one copy of his album because he only did one version. So I have his this photo card and then this little strip. I don't know if there's more strips, but I know there's more photo cards. And um, these are like the postcards that he did. Super super cute. And then this is the stickers. Um, and then for Jin Young, I did buy his solo release as well because I absolutely adored his song. So I have these three photo cards. I don't know if there are more or if they're not, but these are the ones that I got. And yeah, that's basically it for my second alt group binder. Um, I also alt one more group, which has their own binder because I just collect way too much stuff for them. Um, and that's the next binder that we're getting into, but yeah. That kind of is that on that, I guess. And now we're going to get into my... Stray Kids binder. Okay, because this was such a, like, a recent idea for me, um, I don't have anything on the front, and this is a definitely a different kind of binder. Um, I'm thinking of changing all my binders, honestly. Like, I, sometimes I like those binders, sometimes I don't like them. So I don't even know what I'm gonna do with those, but for right now, Stray Kids binder looks like this. So let's open it her up. Um, it has like a nice pocket. I like these pockets better, actually. I really, really prefer them. Um, as you can see, I have just some random stuff in here, some freebies, some, some fan sign stuff that I didn't get into, you know, the usual, um, just a Stray Kids, because this used to be part of my boy group's binder, but then I altered them and added them in here, so it's a whole thing. But for Stray Kids, I am slowly, slowly, slowly starting to collect all of Hyunjin and Nino's cards. Um, it's kind of like a goal I've always had for myself, is to try to collect, like, somebody, like, fully collect them, and for Stray Kids, I do double bias Kenjin and Mino sometimes, I don't know. Kenjin's my bias, but Mino's like my boyfriend is, is complicated, we live in a complicated society, y'all. Um, and so I decided to slowly, slowly, slowly start, but I don't want to get rid of any of my other cards, so it's kind of like a complicated thing. So anyways, for mixtape, I got these two cards, and this is my um, Stay First Generation fan ship card, um, the V-Live thing, I got this, um, so I'm just gonna keep that there. This is from I Am Not, I have Jisung's baby card, Woo Jin, and then this subunit, and then the other version of I Am Not, I got Mino's baby card, um, and then those two cards, super, super cute, I love Stray Kids cards, like, so, so much. And then for I Am Who, um, I got Hyunjin's draw card, I Am Bang Chan, and then I Am's draw card, and then Bang Chan and Mino, so, yes, like I said, I'm going very, very slow with this. Uh, that's why most of like the more older releases, I don't have anything um, of my biases. The recent ones, I do. So uh, for these ones, this is I Am You. I have Changbin and Mino and then Wujin and then these units. Um, for I Am You, I've bought three copies. For the other ones, I've only bought two so far, like both versions. But for I Am You, I've bought extra copies. Um, Cause I'm insane. So yes, I'll probably buy more copies in a bit. Um, and then we go into how I'm going to be organizing my like bias cards. So for Mido onwards, I'm collecting Hyunjin, Mino, Changbin because those are my top three. Um, but for like the older ones that are like way more pricey, I'm only going to be collecting Hyunjin and Mino. So this is how it's going to be set up for like Mido on essentially. So I have almost all of them. I don't have a lot of Mino's cards because I bought all of Hyunjin's um, when I went to see them last time on tour. I bought them from a girl and picked them up at the tour. But this time when I go, I'm going to be picking up more cards from another girl that I bought. Um, so that's really exciting. So most of Minos are I'm going to be getting when I go see them. So this is kind of how I set it up though. Um, Changmin's I haven't bought yet just because I'm a little tentative on buying his cards because I just, I hate spending money. Like if I'm being honest, I really hate spending money. So yes, I do have both of the traditions so I just bought this one recently. Um, so very exciting. And then these are just the extra Mido cards that I have that I'm not probably not going to get rid of because I just love all the other members so much that I don't want to like not have any of the other members. Like I really enjoy having the other members. Um, and then I also have this one lone IN card. Um, and then for Yellowwood, it's going to be the similar. Um, I have all of Hyunjin and Mido's though for this one and I don't have any Changmin really. Um, so it's going to be like that. And then this one, I don't know what this is. I need to figure out where to put these cards if I'm being honest. Uh, but yeah, super, super cute. And then these are my extra Yellowwood cards. Um, I adore them. I'm probably not going to get rid of them. I still never pull Jisung though. And Jisung's my number four, technically, if I could pick a number four. Um, so, kind of upsetting, but whatever. And then we have the limited edition cards and then the limited edition sticker sheet. And then these are the pre-orders that I got. Um, I did pull double Wujin, um, which is kind of frustrating. But nobody wanted to trade with me, so I decided to keep them. And then for the big pre-order cards, um, I pulled... Hyunjin, Changmin, Jisung, and Woojin actually. And then I ended up buying Minos because I bought it 
found it for a really good price. It was $4 um, on Depop, so I decided to buy it. Um, so yeah, I have these ones and then the lone, the lone Mujin right here. And then for the Mido, I have one side of the limited edition thingy. I need to buy the other side, but I'm just not, I don't want to. And then for IMU, the big cards, I have Jisung, Mujin, and Felix. And I'm not going to get rid of these. I'm probably just going to buy Hyunjin and Mido's. Um, because I don't want to get rid of them. And then for Levanter is a little bit different because I tried to get into a fan sign. If you guys have not seen those videos, I will link them all down below. My Stray Kids struggles like are just horrible, guys. I try to get into so many fan signs for this group. I try to meet them so often and I've never ever had the chance. Even for their tour, I could not get high touch. Like I tried really hard. I had six devices. I had just gotten off my flight from Korea. I was really jet lagged and of course I didn't get any high touch, so these kids never want to meet me and that's okay, but for Levanter I decided to buy all, I mean collect all of the photo cards because I had so many albums. I think I bought like for myself at least 20 albums, um, so that's fun. So this is the selfie set, um, Felix's is coming in the mail, I'm trading, or I'm buying it with the set of Mino cards. I needed to buy one card because I, I don't know why, but I was short one card, so I decided to buy this one because I can never find a trade for it. Um, and then this is the blue border. This is the only three cards that I need. Chan's, Seungmin's, and Jungin's a blue border. Like, please, if anybody has it, please trade with me because I need them. And then we have a full green border set. It's so pretty. Um, I literally love it. Um, and then we have, this one's coming in the mail really soon. Um, full name set. And then I do have a full standing set. And this is the easiest one to collect. I think I have literally got this done in like two seconds. Um, for the lenticular cards, I only decided to collect my top four, which is Hyunjin, Mino, Changmin, and Jisung. Uh, because I bought four copies of the Alp. Oh my god, he's playing with a squeaky toy. Um, and then for the Stay in London photo book, I got Chan, Mino, and Jisung. And then I got Jungin's little Polaroid. Oh my god! He's only squeaking it when I talk, guys. Like, I'm dead serious. And then I have two of these uh, District 9 Unlock. Uh, Polaroids, so I have Kyunjin and Linos. Um, I traded for these at the tour because I bought enough merchandise to have two of them. And then for the random draw, if you were a member of Fanship, you got to do my random draw, and I got Kyunjin's, which is super cute. So, um, and then for the like random photos, um, I bought ten of them. So I got Chan, Changbin, 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 Kyunjin, Jisung. Felix, Seungmin, Ayan, Ayan. Um, and then this is the V Life Heartbeat Awards. Did like a little thingy majig where you could get like random photos. Like you could get like each member individually too, but it had every single group. And I didn't have fanship for V Life Heartbeat, um, but I did go. And my friend had fanship and she was like, um, I can get you something um, because we went together and she felt bad for me. So she got me this one, which is super cute. It's like a little. Um, Strike his thing, and these are some more Ariel tries to get into a strike his fan sign and fails little thingies. So, yes, that is my ooh, updated strike his binder. Um, as I go and like grow it, I will show you guys it more. But for now, this is all we got, and now we're getting in to the biggest binder that I have. This is gonna take so much time. I already have been filming for like an hour, and I'm gonna cry, but we're gonna go into my boy group's binder. <laughs> Alrighty, everybody. This is the boy group's binder. She is very thick. She's about four or five inches. I don't even know. Uh, don't listen to what this says. It has so many groups in it. I don't even know. This doesn't make any sense. This thing is so full, and I don't know what I'm going to do with her when she's done. I just... It's a mess. My life is a mess. That's just how it's going to be. And now my camera's dying. No! Okay, guys. I don't even remember what I was saying. It's been a while. Um, I had to take the dogs out. My... Uncle called me and then I just remembered that the Stray Kids District um, 9 Unlock Tour merch thingy majiggy like pre-order went on sale and I forgot that I had to do that so I just bought my merch. I secured two things which is pretty nice. I secured the Polaroid set and Hyunjin's key ring um, which means I need to buy Lino's at the concert which is going to be so stressful but whatever. Uh, we'll figure it out. Um, so yes, this is my boy group binder. Um, let's get into her. This is not- oh! It starts off with 80s which kind of comes next in rotation um, and this is just like creepy stuff. So for 80s, I'm not going to go into everything, but this is the first mini, second mini, um, third mini, both versions, and then their first full-length album. I got, tried to get into 80s fan sign, and that did not work either, so I have a bunch of random 80s photo cards as well. Guys, Ariel's fan sign luck is at an all-time minimum. There's no chance for me to get into a fan sign anytime. Um, so this is the black version, and then this is the white version. I do have two Wuyungs, which I don't know why I do, but I do, so that's cool. Um, and this is the repackaged, like, anniversary edition thingy-majiggy, and I got Wuyung's little baby cuddly! He's so cute! I love him! 
me so cute. Um, and that's it for ATs. Um, I used to store a lot of stuff in here for them, but it just took up too much room, and honestly, I can't be bothered. So next we go into 17. So for 17, we start off with directors. Cut. Yeah, um, this is like the random director's cut stuff and then we this is AL1. I think this is teenage No, this is going 17 going 17. This is teenage. I don't even know you guys I have a lot of 17 cards and I don't really know what I'm doing with them I also have another uh, director's cut card right here. Um, I don't know why he's there, but My logic is good. Um, and then we go into you make my day. No, you make my day. Um, so I have two versions but then two copies of one version um i don't have the rose core and the the pink one set the sun i don't have set the sun version yet um because that one's actually out of print um so these are the cards that i have so far um as you can see i have two of this one follow up and i have one neat and then for you made my day i have all three versions so these are the cards that i pulled and the stickers super super cute and then for this is an ode um i do have a lot of i have all five <laughs> versions so this is the uh begin cards and then the poet and then this is like one sticker and then i have the other sticker here and then this is uh hope cards and then Truth cards, if that makes sense. I don't even know if that makes sense. And then these are all the real cards. Um, super cute. And then these are the random photo, like, tour goods thingy-majiggies that I bought. I don't know why I bought them, but I did. It was cheap. I got two Hoshis. I don't, I don't know. These are the Teenage Standies. So I have Hoshi and Vernon and Wooji. Um, I need one more copy of Teenage, the orange version, but I haven't bought it yet, so. <laughs> then these are the Director's Cut, um... Postcards, so I have scoops, um, and then I got June's coming. Um, I bought another copy of Director's Cut. Um, oh no, no, I pulled two scoops full of postcards in my first one, so I traded for Sun Quan, which I have here, and then I bought the other version of Director's Cut, and I pulled June. So June's are coming. Um, they're just in the albums, which are in the mail. So I have Sun Quan as well, and then we go into the Lenticulars. I don't know which ones these are from, but I have these ones, and then these ones, and then these ones. Um, and then this is my AL1 postcard, and then we go into like the behind the scenes cards from You Made My Dawn, and then this is like the little paddle. I don't even know whose paddle it is. Whose paddle are you? Mingyu. It's Mingyu's paddle. That's cute. Um, I'm just gonna put him there. Um, and then these are the other ones. I got two DKs. Then these are the photos from the 17 pop up store in Latte Young Plaza, I think. I don't even know. I don't even know what you would call it, but these are the photos. So it was like 1,000 won, or like $1 for each photo. So I got um, Vernon and Mingus, which are my bias and my bias sucker. So these are Vernon's. And then these are Mingus. They're super, super, super pretty. It was for an ode. Um, and then we get the an ode little pictures. I do want to get like the ones that go like this, but I don't, mine aren't big enough. So I'll do that eventually, maybe. Um, so this is Vegan with the stickers, the poet with the stickers, hope, truth, and real. Um, and yeah, that's my 17 collection. On to TXT. So for TXT, uh, I have both their albums. Uh, this is from Dream Chapter Star. I have Bungyu and uh, Subin. Um, and then from Dream Chapter Magic, I have Yunjin and Taehyun's uh, Photo cards, and then I have Yunjin and Kai, and then Yunjin and Subin. Super, super cute. And then these are the Dream Chapter Star little uh, sticker seats that are super, super cute. Um, and then we go into Astro. For Astro, I have a ton of albums that I'm literally not going to remember the names of, so let's get into it. Um, so we have, this is all light, I think. Yes. Um, and then this is my high touch wristband. I did high touch with Astro at their concert in LA. Uh, these are all my all light photo cards. I don't know why they're first. They don't, they don't make sense, but it, I don't know. Um, and then we have Autumn Story. We have both versions. I have a lot of Umu because that's just what I bought. I bought a lot of Umu. And this is from Spring Up. There we go. Spring Up. I love how this is first. This is third. And yep, my logic. Um, and then we have, this is Dream Part 2. Yeah, Dream Part 2. Wow, I'm a genius. Um, and then we have Dream Part 1, which I only have three of, and then this is from Rise Up. Um, yeah. I'm not even telling you guys members. You should just know who they are. And then this is from uh, Blue Flame. Um, so I have all of these from Blue Flame. Got a lot of Rocky. I don't know what was happening in Korea. Korea was doing that. Um, and then we go into all light, like, random stuff. So these are the postcard thingy-majiggies. 
um, and they all have like each little messages on the back, so I didn't put them back to back. Super pretty, like I adore these. Um, and then this is like the group photo, and then the stickers, and then the lyric is like a member lyric, so I put it back here, and that's Jinjin. Um, and the other version's postcards, which are again just so pretty. Um, and then this group post uh, photo postcard, um, the stickers, and then for this version, I got Moonbin, super, super cute, and then for Rise Up, I got Rocky's clear card, and then for Blue Flame, um, I don't know why, I don't know what was happening here, but one postcard fits perfectly, and then the other postcard doesn't fit horizontally, I don't know, I don't know, but this is, uh, the story version and the other version, which I can't really keep seem to remember right now, but I got MJ's postcards for both, um, and then these are just other random postcards that you get in the albums, so I'm pretty sure this is one of them is from Spring Up. One of them's from Dream. I don't remember. Anyways, uh, then we go into Kim Dong Han, who is my favorite male soloist right now in K-pop, other than Baekhyun. If Baekhyun's Beck, Beck kind of a soloist, but he's kind of not. But like, if he's considered a soloist, he's my favorite. But if he's not, Kim Dong Han's my favorite. I'm obsessed with this man. I love him so so much. Um, I saw him in Korea for the first time, and I was like, ooh. Um, so I have all of his albums, except I only have one version per album. So this is the first mini, and then the second mini, and then the third mini, and then this is the bookmark of the third mini. It all fits really pretty on here, and I love it, so I love him. I will be buying the other versions when I go back to Korea, because they're really cheap in Korea. They're not so cheap here, so that's that on that. He's beautiful, and I love him. Um, end of that. Then we go to the boys, which I adore. Um, I don't remember when any of this is from. This is from the first mini. This is from the first single, this is from the second mini, second mini, this is from the third mini, I think, I don't remember, this is from The Sphere, this is all their first single, and then this is from the second single, and then this is from Dreamlike, which is their fourth mini, I'm pretty sure. If I did that correctly, I'm a genius, if I didn't, oh well. Um, and yeah, I'm not gonna go through members' names, because honestly, my brain cannot handle that. Also, this one, this one's really, this one's new, I love it. Um, and these are from Dreamlike, I got Eric's, um, lyric thingy, and then Kevin's postcard, Kevin... Um, and then for the third mini, the only, um, I got Sunwoo's transparent thingy. It only fits in this one. I don't know why it fits. It's, it's whack, y'all. Just, and then for Bloom Bloom, which is their, uh, second single, um, I got, uh, Hual and, actually, no. Is this from Bloom Bloom? I really don't remember. Yeah, it's gotta be from, okay. From Bloom Bloom, um, I got Hual and Kevin's, um, postcards. I also got Hual's postcard from the uh, uh, the sphere the sphere that's what it's called but I didn't put it in here I don't know why anyways we go into SF9 which is not all SF9 this is this is false advertisement this is SF9 and day six technically out guys my brain uh, this is also not in any chronological order and I still need to order SF9's new album but I'm a coward so stream good guy for clear skin though um this is from sensuous this is from sensuous this is from narcissist and narcissist and this is from rpm um, i'm not going to go into names because honestly i can't think right now and then this is from the first breaking sensation oh burning sensation i'm a coward burning sensation this is from oh Sole mio uh what's it called knights of the sun i call it oh Sole mio and this is from mamma mia so yeah the limited edition mamma mia and then we have this from Nights of the Sun, this is from Mamma Mia, and then this are the two Day 6 things I got, because I bought a Day 6 album, and I didn't know what to do with these, so I put them here. Genius! Okay. Oh my god, we're halfway through. This next one is X1, of course, X1, if those of you guys don't know, uh, did, um, trigger warning, disband. Oh, I hate that word, I hate this, I hate everything. So, these are from when X1 was a thing, um, yeah, still triggered by it, literally don't talk to me about it, because I will cry, and I still haven't gotten Johan's photo cards, and I probably am gonna cry a lot about it, but for the Quantum Leap version, I have Usak and Unsung, and then for the B Song version, I have Hangyul and Unsung, and then Hangyul's bookmark, and uh, Juno's bookmark, um, and then for the postcards, I have these two as well. So much to say about them, but I'm not going to talk about it in this video, so we're just going to move on, like, right now. Then we go to AB6, um, which technically shouldn't be here because I decided CIX is higher than AB6 the other day, but, like, that's kind of tea, but you didn't hear that from me. Anyways, from their first mini, we have these five. I do have two Dequis, um, they're just kind of chilling here. I haven't found a trade for it, so I'm, again, a coward, and I just don't really care that much. Um, and then from their sec- their first full album- oh my god, I can't even speak. First full album, I have all of these, um, super, super cute, though. Put a lot of womb, which is my baby. Um, and these are from the first mini, um, and these are like the group cards and the sixes, little bookmarks. So that's that on that. No questions asked. That's just that. 
Then we go into Oneus, which I absolutely adore this group. Um, so for their first mini, we have Raven and Xion's um, Toto cards, and then the sticker, and then the scratch card, which is Edo's, which I haven't scratched yet. I'm sorry. I just don't want to scratch it. Like, it just stresses me out. Then from the second mini, I have both versions. So we have Konhi and Xion again, and then from the third mini, I have uh, Ido and Konhi as well. Literally, none of my bias, but like, that's totally fine. And then for the postcards, I have Ravens and uh, Soho's, which is super nice because Soho is my bias wrecker, but still no Huan Wung. And like, Huan Wung just is a coward. I'm sorry. I said it. You heard it from me. Um, and then we get into CIX, which I absolutely adore. Um, this is all from their first mini. Um, I did buy three, t both versions, and then I bought an extra one of one. I got an extra Yonghee uh, uh, photo card, um, and I don't know where it went. For being honest, I don't know where it is, but so I should have another one here, but like it's fine. Uh, I really would like to get another Sungun photo card, but then I would have to get an extra Yonghee because then it would just. It looks fine right now, and I'm gonna keep it like this. Um, so I have two BX, two Jin Young, and two Kyunsuk, and then one Sungun and one Yonghee. Um, and then from their second mini, I got. Both versions of the album, like I said, again, I got a lot of BX. I don't know why I did, but that's what Korea said was gonna happen, so that's that. And then these are the, like, drawing little cards. Um, I have all of them, and then these are, like, the, I don't even know, I don't know what this is, but I have it. Great. Um, and then for New East, um, I don't want to collect them at all, but I just have a lot of their stuff because reasons so for happily ever after i kind of want to get all four albums because happily ever after is such a good album like it's so good honestly so is the table though so i'm like i don't know anyways for happily ever after i bought one at a used k-pop a used bookstore in korea and it only came with one photo card which is minhyun which i wanted because minhyun's my bias so i bought that and then the one i bought like sealed um had jr and aaron i was like this way fine and then i bought one the table which has jr ren and minhyun and minhyun's ar card which i was like wow this is so great no Beko though, and Beko literally snatches my entire existence. Like, what the heck? Um, and then I have Aaron's little fold-out card thingy magic. Oh my god! So yeah, like I said, we have their first mini, I have two Ruben cards, and then the second mini I have the group card Ruben and Jaehyun. And then the second mini also came with postcards, so I have all of the members and then the group card. And like I also have the little envelope in here as well. Then we go into Very Very, who is another group I absolutely adore. Also need to get their new release because their new release is slaps. If you guys aren't streaming layback, I don't know what you're doing. Oh my god, I love it. Um, so their first mini I have, no, this is their second and third mini, I think. I don't have the first one yet. So I have Gehyun, Gehyun, and then Minchan. Gehyun is my bias, so that's why I kind of bought these. And then, um, yeah. Good. And then I also have, they came with like little postcard-y thingy majiggies, and there's only three, which kind of really upsets me, but again, we're not going to talk about that. And then we go to Monster X, which I do have a lot of cards for, but I don't have a lot of albums for, which doesn't make any sense, but whatever. These ones are from that one album that's black. May or not be take me here, are you there? No, take 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 me take you here. That one. Um, I pulled Shonu and Minhyuk in my album, but my friend kindly gifted me Kihyun. And then I have one uh, follow find you, and I pulled Shonu and Minhyuk. Super nice because these are my top three. So lit. Although Changkyun, Changkyun, um, I don't know. Anyways, then for the like the random things, I got Minhyuk and Ju Honey. Uh, so I got these. And I also bought a lot of Tony Moly stuff while I was in Korea. I don't know why. I kind of went crazy. So I have all of like the, I have one set of the postcards because my friend and I split them. And then I had I have these uh, little photo cards that are too big for any like regular sleeves. And it also comes with like little message cards. So I just put them here. Looks cute. And then we go into GOT7. So for GOT7, I have one copy of Spinning Top and one copy of, uh, what's the album called? You calling my, call my name? It was it called? Call my name. Oh my god, I can't even speak. Um, so I have Jackson, Bam Bam, and then Young Jay, and then I do have one copy of Just Choose uh, Focus because I absolutely adored that release as well. And then I have all of the pre-order benefits for the two ones that I bought. So this is for Spinning Top. Um, I put the members like back to back. So this is the Spinning Top, and then this is the um, Call My Name one. So I put them back to back. Uh, there's no member order. I'm absolutely chaotic, and I feel like you guys should just know that. So that's that on that. 
And then we go into random boy groups question mark. That's an exclamation point. It should be in a question mark. Um, this is just random stuff that I only have like one album for that I don't really feel like giving them their own section. So for Pentagon, I have one Lonely Ganon photo card. For Ace, I have one Lonely Wow photo card. And then for um, Victon, I have one Lonely Byungchan photo card, who I still don't know if is my bias. I cannot pick a bias in Victon, and it's really, really frustrating. It's between Byungchan, Sejun, and Chan, and I have no idea what my bias is. Um, but I bought this in Korea, and it came with Byungchan's photo card and Sejun's postcard, so I was like, I'll buy it. And then uh, I do have Ace's, like, tattoo set, and then I also have 17's, like, debut uh, postcards in here. I don't know what I'm gonna do with them, and then I also have some more freebies. And yeah, that's basically it for um, my boy group of binder. I'm sorry, it's so chaotic. It really doesn't make sense, and I don't know why it is like this, but that's just kind of how it is. I do need to make it smaller, um, and I know I do, but I will be working on that really slowly, I guess, and yeah. Now we're gonna move on to the tiniest girl group binder you've probably ever seen in your life, and then we're gonna be done, and I'm gonna be so happy, so let's get it. Okay, here is my girl group binder. It has red velvet, black, pink, G Idol, that's not it. It has more than that, but for right now, that's what it says. Um, like I said, I need to update all of this. All of my divider sheets need to be updated as well, but I am just really lazy. You guys should just know this by now. Um, so this one has another cute little pocket. Like, I just, the ones with the pockets really make me happy. Um, and these have some Revy Pastel Finale stickers. I don't know why. Um, we start with Red Velvet. Red Velvet is my alt girl group, um, so I have the most of their cards. I have their full album collection, except for, for member covers. I only buy one member, I only buy Irene, who's my bias, um, but everything else I have, like, um, completed. So this is like, uh, ice cream, automatic, I think. I have three versions, and then the, I don't even know what this is, the red, Russian roulette, the velvet. Yeah, I'm not gonna go into it, guys, I don't remember anything. Um, I did have a Wendy curse for a time, and then now I don't have a Wendy curse anymore, so it's kind of confusing. Now I have a Sulgi curse, so... That's how it is. Um, more recently, this is Bad Boy, this is Summer Magic, um, and then this is RBB, and then we have Rebe Festival Day 1, Rebe Festival Day 2, with Irene's gorgeous Slenderman card. Like, I'm so thankful. Thank you so, so much, SM. I can't believe I pulled that card. <laughs> and then we have, like, the Rebe Festival, like, little thingies. And then for Rebe Festival Finale, um, I just did my unboxing really recently. I pulled Irene and um, Yeti, which is super, super cute. Um, and then I have some of their, like, postcardy stuff. So this is from the Rebe Festival. And this is from the Rebe Festival as well. And then we go into Chungha, who is my favorite female soloist. I only have one of her albums is right now. I only have the fourth mini, I think, flourishing. Um, I do need to get the rest of hers, but this is what I have so far. I have one photo card and one postcard. Wow. Whew, I know. I'm doing great. Um, and then we went to Blackpink, which is my second favorite fe female group. Um, and I have uh, Square Up. I have both versions. And then Kill This Love, I only have one. Will I get the other one? Maybe, maybe not. Probably, if I like their next release, I'll probably buy it just so I have a full collection. But if I don't like their next release, I'll probably just buy one version of it. Um, because Kill This Love wasn't my favorite from them. I really thoroughly enjoyed Square Up. And like, ask anybody around me, I still bump all those tracks. But Kill This Love was definitely not my favorite thing that they did. So, I only bought one version. Um, and then I have all of the extras from both of their albums. Um, and then from Jenny's solo album as well. And these are the Kill This Love um, little like small photo thingy majiggies, I don't even know. Um, and then for Idol, I have both of their first, both their minis. Um, this is from the first mini, and this is from the second mini, and this is from the first mini as well. Um, yeah, they don't have a lot of stuff, so that's that. Also, I need to use these pockets because there's no point in using like a nine pocket for them. And then for Itzy, I do have one of their albums, um, but I have a lot of their stuff, so this is from their first mini. Um, their, I think they only have one album, though. anyways. This is like the pre-order benefit. Um, and then I have all of the pre-order benefits as well. They're super pretty. I absolutely adore these girls. I probably will buy the other version of their album. And definitely in the future, like, I will buy more of their albums because I really, really like them. Um, and then for Twice, um, I have one uh, version of Feel Special. Um, this is my first al Twice album I ever bought, ever. I do want to get a version of Fancy because I really, really enjoy that album. And I think I'm going to go back and get Twice albums that I really enjoy. Like, um, Twice to Graham I'll probably buy and maybe... Dance the Night Away. I don't even know if that's the name of the album, but maybe I'll buy more. But for right now, I only have this one. And then I have all of the pre-order benefits. And then I got Nyan's um, lyric sheet book thing. My jig. And the, oh my god. And then for the last one, it is Luna, Eyes One, and Wiki Makey. So I only have one album for all of these girls. Um, girl groups. So for Luna, I have one copy of Plus Plus. Or no, this is XX. Is this XX or Plus Plus? Unknown. Um, and then for Eyes One, I have one copy of... 
Violetta, whatever that out. What is it? Hard Eyes. Oh my god, guys, I don't know any album names. And then for Wiki Nikki, I have one copy of Weekend LOL. Um, so most of these, like this one I bought because Yu Jung is my bias, but these ones I just pulled. Um, and yeah, that's my girl group binder. She's really small. Like, really? That's it. That's it, everybody. Um, but yeah, let me put everything else into frame, and we'll do an outro. Alright, guys, thank you so, so much for watching today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I'm sorry that it was really crappy, and I'm sorry my dogs interrupted me every five seconds, so it took literally, it took me almost three hours to film this. Um, yay me. I'm so excited to edit this, but hope you guys enjoyed it nonetheless. I love you guys, and I will see you guys in about six months with my photo cards. Actually, Maybe a little bit more than six months. Yeah, maybe actually six months. Six months is July. Yeah. So probably like when I get back from Korea in July, um, I will do another one of these. Um, but yeah, until then, you guys will not see these babies. Hopefully they will be better when you see them next. But um, yeah, I love you guys. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye, guys. Where's the camera? There's the camera. <laughs>